Wave 3 of the Booster Course Pass just released today. In this video, I will be talking about a track that is guaranteed to be in the Booster Course Pass, being Wii Rainbow Road, which will happen in Wave 6. I know it's a long way until we get Wave 6, but there are some major points on why Wii Rainbow Road will be in the Booster Course Pass. According to the Wave 6 data mine leak, the last track of the Spiny Cup is going to be a Wii track, and for those who don't know, the Spiny Cup is the last cup of the Booster Course Pass, and it makes perfect sense to include a Rainbow Road track. Another point to make is that 3DS Rainbow Road was included in the first half of the Booster Course Pass, and it was the last track in Wave 3, so the last track of Wave 6 should be a Rainbow Road track, which I mentioned before. Another thing to point out is that it's not going to be Dry Dry Ruins, just because it was data mined in Mario Kart Tour. There are also plenty of Mario Kart 7 tracks that are not in the Booster Course Pass. And even in the Booster Course Pass, tracks like Shroom Ridge and Snowland are still not in Mario Kart Tour, making the options very open for the Booster Course Pass. When Wave 6 is announced in 2023, no one is going to talk about Vancouver Velocity or Maple Treeway. It's just going to be about Wii Rainbow Road because we haven't seen that track since Mario Kart Wii, which is like 14 years ago. I hope you liked this video about Wii Rainbow Road. Be sure to like and subscribe to my channel and comment down below on what tracks you want to see in the Booster Course Pass.